Aston Martin Vantage GTE race car review. Though Aston Martin had more than enough news in revealing the new V8 Vantage, it decided it needed to show one more thing, the Vantage GTE race car. Obviously the bodywork is based on the road car, but it's more aggressive. It has an even bigger version of the V8 Vantage's massive grille. The hood gets extra vents. The exhaust now exits at the front fenders. And, of course, it gets a huge wing and equally monster diffuser. The interior is quite a bit different, though, with the comfy seats and leather trim gone in favor of a roll cage and bare carbon fiber components. Under the skin, there are some similarities to the regular V8 Vantage. The main connection is the Vantage GT exemption, which is a version of the same 4.0-liter twin-turbocharged AMG V8 found in the road car. It makes more power than the street version with at least 530 horsepower. Torque is roughly the same, though. Instead of an 8-speed automatic, the Vantage GTE uses a 6-speed sequential manual transmission. Both cars use double wishbone suspension front and rear, but the GTE gets adjustable anti-roll bars and Allen's adjustable shocks. The brakes are also upgraded to 6 piston front calipers and 4 piston rear calipers from Alcon. It will start racing in the Fire World Endurance Championship in 2018.